You have founded over 60 corporations, including the Golf Channel in the UK, mm -hmm. three TV networks. You have a global business empire. Your success is unprecedented. So what is the truth about the law of attraction for you? Well, you know, a lot of people, as you mentioned, know me as author these days, Natural Cures. They don't want you to know about was number one on the New York, on the New York Times bestseller list 26 weeks in a row. My books have actually sold close to 50 million copies around the world. And I founded three television networks in the UK. The Golf Channel was one of them. Uh, I've, had, I've had over 60 corporations or entities around the world, and they've generated around $3 billion. So for years, people have always asked me, will you write a book? But I decided to, to put together some information on how to be successful, how to use the law of attraction, because there is a missing secret in Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. Mm -hmm. There's a missing element to the secret which describes the law of attraction. I've used it. I've generated $3 billion in business over the years. Friends of mine who have done even much much more than that all use a very simplistically designed method to this program actually gives people their own Aladdin's lamp and their own personal gene that when you use this technique you can virtually cre create whatever you want in your life. You can have, you can have, be, or do whatever you want. And I can tell people this. I've done this my whole life. My life has been magical. I have no education. I didn't grow up on the, the right side of the tracks. I didn't go to Harvard. I didn't go to college. I didn't have a nickel growing up. And I created this. And I, be, I have a secret that I was taught in 1975. So before you started any of this? Yes, a group of people came to me, and I got it in, inducted into the organization called the Brotherhood, which is like it a skull and bones. It sounds very Da Vinci Code. Well, it's, it's like, it's like it, hey, the skull and bones is at Yale. Yeah. We, we know that's a secret society. Mm -hmm. The Freemasons are a secret society. The Bilderberg Group is a secret society. These are all not so secret anymore. Mm -hmm. What goes on inside them are still secret. But the fact is, when you're in, you actually learn how to, we call it manipulating energy. Another way to say it is you're taught how to use your brain and focus your... We are as a people, inherently and historically, opposed to secret societies, to secret oaths, frequency vibration, and to secret to proceedings. To create in life what you want. Now, I was, I was inducted in, into an organization called the Brotherhood back in the 70s. And I actually left that organization in 19, uh, uh, 1999. Was the Brotherhood similar to what you're talking about? Correct. And I learned secret information. So what I did So what I did So what I did so what I did, so what I did, so what I did,